Sepsis is a time-dependent medical emergency. One in every five people that develop sepsis in Ireland will die. Every hour delay in commencing treatment is associated with a higher risk of mortality. Some patients, for example the elderly, those with chronic illness and those who are immunocompromised are at greater risk of sepsis and have higher mortality. Early recognition and treatment of sepsis gives patients the best opportunity for survival and minimises the long-term complications of sepsis. Signs and symptoms of sepsis are not always obvious in presentation. It is important to listen to the concerns of the patient or their family. Carry out a complete medical review for all high-risk patients who present with or deteriorate from suspected infection. Clinical judgment is very important, but I recommend using the sepsis form to support your assessment, diagnosis and treatment plan, including initiation of the sepsis 6 bundle. Once sepsis is suspected or diagnosed, commence sepsis 6. Take 3. Blood cultures, lactate and blood tests, urinary output. Give 3. IV antimicrobials, IV fluids, oxygen. The decision to instigate the sepsis 6 is considered time zero. Document this time on the sepsis form or the clinical notes as it will help guide the patient's response to treatment and inform the need for escalation to more senior personnel. Ideally, the sepsis 6 form should be completed within one hour of the decision to treat. Use the fluid algorithm for a judicious approach to fluid resuscitation. If the patient is not responding to initial treatment, escalate it to a senior team member. Using the sepsis form will help you with this decision. Effective teamwork and communication are critical to the management of patients with sepsis. Prompt recognition and timely appropriate treatment will prevent the need for critical care, reduce the length of stay and minimise the long-term effects of sepsis. Please visit HSC Land to complete your mandatory training for sepsis today.